Hey folks, we are back for the third Let's Play, Chapter 2, Escape from Brule. Now, I just kind of cut up the first video, and it doesn't sound too bad with this new mic. I have, I, I'm just importing the second video from yesterday, and it's getting set up. So we're going to play this again. I've taken off the, the foam thing I put over it. The foam thing was actually from my old mic, and I didn't know if it helped. But I'm not going to know if this works if I don't try it. So this LP... Hopefully it's not too tinny. The other thing is our room is still kind of echoey and I think the mic's better than my other mic and that's why it's picking up stuff. Hopefully you're not hearing me breathing too hard, but I'll work on that and I'll try to fix that if you do. Why don't we get going, escape from rule? Oh, before we go any farther, we are at a jello alert level zero and a ghost alert level zero. He's asleep, he's at work, and, it, and I got that reversed, so yes, it's jello at work. Let's get going. Isara, Martha, please be okay. <gasps> okay, gunshot's not a good sign. Martha. Where's your gun, dude? What's her problem? Is she pregnant or just fat? Who cares? Not gonna make any difference when she's dead. Stop this now. See what she's wearing? Take a good look at that shawl. She's a dark sin. And that explains it. I thought this place stunk. Now I know it does. So we got ourselves a fat one and a stinky one. P.U. It's a regular pig farm in here. Shoot him in the face, babe. Shoot him in the face. I will thank you to watch your tongue in this house. You have to leave now. That's a big gun for such a little girl. Drop it. Isara! Huh? Hold it right there! <gasps> Bam! Die! Nice shot, Isara. Dark son, big. <sighs> Isara. Are you okay? I'm okay, thanks to you. But Martha, I think she's... Martha! This isn't good. She's gone into labor. <clears throat> Moving her would be dangerous. Right. Well, we can't just leave her here. What are we gonna do? There are a lot of Imperials out there, Ys. It's only a matter of time before they take over the Mill Plaza. Welks, listen. The barn out back. What about it? Our fathers have left us something. Something that might get us out of this mess. Woo! Could it be the tank? I think it could be. Let's do it. Let's get to the tank. Because, you know, people just carry tanks in a garage. That's what they do here. Do you have a permit for that? That's tank. Wow, I can't believe it's still here. And it's one of a kind. Here it is, the Edelweiss. Tamer built it especially for General Gunther. Yeah, and it worked great too. So it's just been parked here in the barn? I wanted to make sure it would still operate, you know, in case of emergencies. I enrolled in a maintenance class given by the military. I wanted to be able to do what my father could do. Well, that's great. But that's only a class, Isara. It really didn't need much. Hardly any alterations at all. I just fitted it with a new turbine engine. It really improves on the power to weight ratio. The Edelweiss is field worthy. Its firepower and mobility are more than a match for recent models. Well, assuming it does work, what's next? All right, Welks, you took the armored vehicle course, didn't you? Yeah, back in high school, once. We'll bring Martha here. She'll be safe inside the tank, and we can move to a better location. Just leave the driving to me, okay? All you have to do is give the orders. Ooh, I'm good at giving orders, folks. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm not really that good at it. He 
Isara, we ready to roll? Engaging engine. The Edelweiss is ready for deployment. Alicia well, could still be out there dodging bullets, buying time for people to evacuate. Here's the plan. We're gonna pick up Alicia and get out of town. All right, Edelweiss, move out! Move out, woo! Feeling pretty good about this. In the tank. All right, a new episode has been added. Retreat from rule. I'm assuming that's the actual um, battle. So we're going to hop right in and let's do this. Here's the brief for this operation. The enemy is a squad centered around a single tank, currently advancing from the plaza onto the main road. We need to defend a gate on that road. If the enemy breaches it, the evacuating townspeople will be in danger. Oh, that's pretty straightforward. They'll probably head for the gate and try to destroy it. The tank will be with them. Our goal is to take out that tank while keeping the gate standing. Without the help of your tank, it's next to impossible for us to destroy their tank. Until we can rendezvous the Brule Town Watch, we'll do everything we can to keep that gate in one piece. The Town Watch will need to hold off the enemy forces until they arrive with the tank. We'll need to use the sandbags around the starting point and gate for cover and hold back the Empire's attack. The victory, the enemy tank is destroyed. Failure, Brule's main gate is destroyed. Welkin dies, Alicia dies, or 20 turns pass. All right, let's get right, into this. Let's begin. We've got to stop them here. If this gate falls, there's going to be even more casualties among the townspeople. We can't allow that. The town watch will defend this gate so as many people as possible can get away. Famous last words. Famous last words. Basically, all that said is, you can use hand grenades to get rid of sandbags so My people turn, can okay? shoot at people trying to get behind those sandbags. So, come on. So, first thing we're going to do, we're going to go over here. We're going to switch to the grenade. Nope, not yet. We're going to run a little closer. Sighted. There we go. A little closer. There we go. Toss that grenade out there. Yeah. Destroy that sandbag. Come on, hon. Nice. So we're going to do that next round, too, because I think what we're going to do is we're just going to huddle. We're just going to huddle down here. Uh, crap. I don't want to be shot at by people. Okay, can I? I can't see what I'm doing here. There we go. There we go. Oh, God, here comes the tank. At least they have unlimited ammo with those rifles. Ouch. Shit. Pardon my language. Oh, you see, that's not bad. There's only like four points of hit. That's pretty. There we go. <laughs> Losers. I think we're going to be okay. Come on, buddy. There we go. Very nice, Mr. Town Watchman. Oh, God, please let the idle vice no. show up. If this keeps up. Oh, yes. Here we go. The tank should be able to breach that wall. It may provide us with a shortcut, Welks. All right, let's give it a shot. Hang in there, Alicia. Oh, hell yeah. We're just going to roll up on that asshole. Oh, I shouldn't have, I should have said this earlier. A tank's weak spot, the weakest spot it is is that glowing blue thing right behind it. That's where their engine and power is. So you always want to try to hit that if you can. Hostile sighted. But we got Hostile plenty of movement sighted. points, so I think we're going to do pretty well here. It's a tank! It's a galleon tank! Welkin, you have a tank? 
I'm sorry, I'm, I'm finger pressed. Yeah, I tend to press quickly, and that was a mistake. We can talk later. Right now, we need to stop those soldiers. Enemy tanks sighted, Welks. Switching to anti tank combat. Armor piercing shells loaded. All right, let's go take it down. That should be enough to kill Fire! that guy. Like that. Hell yeah. I was at the end of my movement, so it's not like I could get hitting on them. Yes, we have tread armor and body armor, or hit points. Glowy blue radiator plate, rear is weak point. So, we have a lot of command points, because I saved Here them up from last time. So we're just going to have me move around and see if I can get that rear shot on this tank here. Because he's facing away. Ooh, there we go. I think we are in luck, folks. The thing is, is it still ha hits anywhere in that ring, so I could miss. But now! Come on. Ooh, and it's on. Look at sparks on fire. It's doing stuff. We're going to take Here one more go. shot with that bad boy. Because the quicker you can wrap this turn up, battle up, the more points you get. Like that, folks. Hell yeah. Yes, we stopped it. Nice work, Ys. Woohoo! Now you're my hero, Welkin. The Imperials are running off for now. Looks like we bought some time, at least. Welks! Welks! It's a boy! Martha had a boy! She... she gave birth in Dad's tank? I am not cleaning that shit yes, up. Yes, and without complications. They're both perfectly healthy. Good. That's fantastic. Now let's stay sharp as we head out of town. Ooh, look at that. An A, because I am awesome. An A for awesome. Awesome. Oop, last episode for this chapter, I think. Because I don't think they go more than two pages. Maybe they do, though. You never know about this stuff. Two hours after the first shots were fired, Bruel was under Imperial control. Though a mere skirmish by Empire standards, the raid on Bruel would mark Welkin Gunther's first taste of battle and begin his rise to a Galleon hero. Alicia. I thought I would be ready for this. I knew war meant this might happen. It hurts. Seeing my town overrun like this, seeing all those people killed, it's just not right. How could all this happen? It isn't human, Welkin. We look at those birds and see how wild and free they are. But they all have their own territories. If anything threatens their home, they'll risk their lives to defend it. People are animals too. We do what we have to, when we have to. Animals are in a constant struggle to stay alive, but I've also seen them help each other, almost like they were cooperating in order to survive. Cooperating? That's why I'm so into studying natural science. That coexistence. I want to know how it works. If we could figure that out, mankind could put it to use for our own survival. That's why I want to be a teacher, so that I can pass that knowledge on to the children. I mean, even if we can't completely eliminate war, at least we might learn to live together as one people. You think so? Welks, look. Martha fell asleep, so that makes me the babysitter. See, Alicia? 
Oh, he's adorable. Just like you said, even in war, new life happens all around us. Come here. Look, that's your hometown. On fire. Someday, we'll come back home again. Yes. Someday soon. I know it. I don't think you actually know. I think it's more of Chapter a maybe. Three. Vassal Urban Warfare. All right, so we have... Ooh, a new episode's been added. All right, so can we go to other tabs? Still nothing else, so that's okay. That's okay. We are going to wrap this up here, folks. I hope the mic is working. We'll see. But like I said, this Let's Play series, it's going to be this mic because I need to give it a chance. And it's also probably going to be the Assassin's Creed Unity that I'm playing, I think, about the same time as I play this. Because once again, I think we're going to mix this up just in case. Not your cup of tea. Or maybe you want a lot of variety, so you get two things from me. Okay, folks, take care.